Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your start menu is not responding after a recent update on Windows 10 or Windows 11. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in settings, best match, or come back with settings, go ahead and open that up. On the left side, you want to select personalization. And then on the right side, you want to scroll down and select taskbar. And just go ahead and left click on that one time. On the right side, scroll down and then underneath taskbar behaviors, go ahead and left click on that to expand it. Where it says automatically hide the taskbar. You want to make sure that is not unchecked. So again, make sure that is not filled in. And then hopefully that would have been able to resolve the problem. Now, for some reason, if you're unable to even get to this part of the tutorial, you just might have to use your mouse cursor and just highlight over the bottom part of your screen, and then you should be able to open up the search menu and then search for the settings window like we just did. So again, if you're unable to get to this point, you can just open up the search menu by dragging your mouse cursor around the sides of the screen until you find the taskbar. So pretty straightforward on that, guys. And that's about it. Something else we can try here as well. Again, if you go down to the bottom of the screen, you search for CMD, best match, you'll come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And I have a couple of commands in the description of my video. Go ahead and copy the first one, hit the DISM scan, and go ahead and copy that and then go to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit and paste it in. Give us a couple minutes to run. Okay, once that has concluded, go ahead and copy the second command in the description of my video and paste it into the command prompt the same way we did the first one and hit enter.
Okay, and once that has concluded, go ahead and close out of here. And I would suggest restarting your computer. Again, the taskbar is set to not be visible by default. That was one of the settings that we changed. So when we restart our computer, it's still not going to be there because I never turned the show visibility back on. So just keep that in mind, but you do want to restart your computer regardless here. So pretty straightforward process. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.